Hey, first grade friends. This is our video for the repeated reading of our Appleseed story, Things That Swim. You can go ahead and pause the video to be my echo, or you can read right along with me. You have your own paper at home, but I have the Appleseeds to go to book in front of me. That's why it might look a little bit different. Let's go ahead and get started. Things That Swim. I hope you kids like things that swim because this is the room where we keep all the fish. The fish here are trout. A trout is a fish that swims in cool lakes and creeks. You can see that they have lots of spots and marks. The spots and marks help the trout hide. They make the trout look a lot like the sand on the bed of a creek. Here is a big fish that makes all of the wee fish run and hide. It's this page. This is a reef shark. It has that name because it likes to make its home close to a reef where there are lots of fish. You can see that the reef shark has fins and a set of gills on its side. You can not see them from here, but this shark has lots of sharp teeth in its mouth. Would a reef shark bite you? Well, you are not the lunch that this shark would like best. A reef shark likes to feed on squid, crabs, and shrimp. But it would be smart not to get the reef shark mad at you all the same. And that is the end of our story. Thank you for reading along with me. I hope you had fun and I will see you next time.